Oh, guys, there are no greater fans than Disney fans, and we've got tens of thousands of them here in the city of Anaheim right now at the Anaheim Convention Center for the D23 Expo. Let's go check it out. I'm here with Killian from SoCal Disney Pinporium, and as you can see behind us, they sell pins. So Killian, tell me about your booth. I'm just selling a lot of pins. There's walls and walls and boards of pins. And where do you get all these pins? I do a lot of buying, selling, and trading throughout uh, Southern California and sometimes out of state as well. Uh, I was actually just at the Florida pin trading event uh, two weeks ago in Epcot. How does D23 compare to other Disney events that you've been to? This event's great. I mean, it's 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 huge. It's it's one of the nicest looking um, events. The people are super friendly. It's right across the street from Disneyland, so it's it's prime location. And so, what is it about Disney pins that people get so excited about? Can you kind of explain that to us? Disney has a wide range of products, and they make pins virtually out of every movie, every character, and just a wide range of. Uh, pins for every collector from young to old. And trading is kind of a sport in itself, right? Right, yeah, a lot of people, they're uh, really into uh, trading. In fact, there's, if you go uh, towards the back of the Emporium, there's a massive uh, pin trading area today. Well, thank you so much, Killian, for talking to us, and I hope you have a great time at D23. Yeah, thank you. I hope you guys have a great time as well. Okay, I'm here with the Bryans from Boston, and they are here at D23 for the first time. You guys been here before? Yeah, first, time. first time at D23. I also want to know about these jackets. Oh, yeah. So what is going on here? So we're just uh, avid pin traders. So we have been to four of the six Disney parks or Disney locations, and we trade pins from all over there, just trying to collect the stuff we like. What yeah. is it about pin trading that's so fun? I don't know. It's a, it is addictive. It's a slippery slope. We started with like a small pack, and then you just get more and more and trade more. It's so addictive. We do it with a lot of our friends too. So uh, we have like a little group with, that we made with our friends. The the diamond. We're all obsessed with it. So <laughs> have you found any cool ones here so far? Oh yeah, uh, I traded uh, Mama Melda from Coco. That was one I got yesterday. And then you got a cool one, right? This one right here is like signed by the artist, which is pretty neat. Yeah, what do you guys look for in pins? Typically stuff from movies that we care about, like Aladdin, Little Mermaid, that kind of stuff. Or we like the ones like Disneyland and uh, Tokyo Disneyland. The uh, Anything from the park or the rides really appeals to us. Yeah, uh, we have no idea which ones are rare or anything. We just kind of pick the ones that we like. Yeah. We know a lot of collectors have like uh, binders with them. This is our whole collection. We just wear the whole thing. <laughs> now, do you guys go to the pin trading like zone, or do you just find people around here? Uh, a little bit of both. We usually trade with cast members, but sometimes, specifically Disneyland has a avid person-to-person -person trading, which is a lot more fun, and you get a lot more uh, rare or not just cool, unique ones. And he's more into negotiating for rare ones. He'll you know, do like two deal. for ones, wheel and deal people. <laughs> Where I'm just like scared that they want like ones that I like. Yeah, you're like, oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to, to tell little kids no is is hard. <laughs> but I think you're like connected to them, right? Yeah, yeah. You have to be able to be like, I'm not willing to trade that one. <laughs> well, thanks guys for talking to us, and yeah, I hope you have nice. a good time. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks, <laughs> Thank guys. You. Thanks, Anna. <laughs> So, Rhonda, tell me, what are you guys selling here today? We have all array of pins from all over, all kinds of Disney pins you'd like. We have great Pooh pins. We have anywhere from, you know, Pinocchio to all the current ones, Milan, Princesses. Anything you'd really like is here. So what are people looking for when they come to your booth usually? Actually pins. Either they collect them because they have a favorite character, maybe a stitch, or they would like to um, start collecting, or they're just looking for that next little thing to put on their lapel. Do you guys have any super rare run ones that you're selling here? 
Oh yes, we have a wall that has some rare ones that you won't find. Um, some, you know, like Disney marquees. There's some Star Wars ones, so there are some very rare ones that are hard to find. Yes. Yeah. And what is it? Uh, what is different about D23 from other things that you guys do, other conventions? Oh, because you have not. This is a Disney. This is Disney. This is where all the fun happens, all the magic happens. So, but then we have people from all over. I mean, we see people from other countries that come over. So, yeah. So there's just. I mean, there's really no boundaries. It's Disney. How do you guys like being here in the city of Anaheim? Oh, love it, love it. You can feel the magic. I hate saying it, but there is. It's magic in the air. Well, thanks for talking to us. Anything else you want to add? No, but come down and see us. We're having a lot of fun here at D23. Thank you, Rhonda. Thank you.